Fantasy Philosophers is brought to you by Fantasy-Info.com. Josh Morgan continued to start for the San Francisco 49ers even after Michael Crabtree came onto the team last year. Josh was in his second season last year and he still did make some strides on this team. He bumped his receptions totals up to 52 last year for 527 yards. He did have three touchdowns. He's really in a situation where his team has to grow a lot before he's going to be a true fantasy relevant player, I would think. He does have talent. He is in his third year and I do think he's going to be a productive player for this team as their number two. But I would say really the true fantasy options here are going to be Michael Crabtree and Vernon Davis in this passing game. With Morgan, again, we're going to have to see if Michael Crabtree for some reason isn't progressing as we would project him out and a lot of people project him out to do after we did see what we saw from him last season. Then Morgan could have more value in that regard. He is coming into his third year, so I would expect him to be a more polished player coming into this season. Obviously, the Niners made some nice projected upgrades on the offensive line and Alex Smith looks to be playing with much more confidence a lot of leadership this offseason so it looks like he's finally starting to get his career on the right track and that's really nice to see from him from all the garbage that he went through with this organization in his early years so with Morgan we're just going to have to wait and see on him to see if something pops out here if maybe he becomes the guy that maybe again we thought Crabtree was going to be or if Vernon Davis goes down it just projects that now that he's going to get more opportunities. So don't look to him for anything for your draft, but he is a guy that over time, like anybody, he could get an opportunity here to be a relevant player for the waiver wire. For more fantasy football information, go to fantasy-info.com and sign up for our free e-newsletter. Good luck in your 2010 fantasy football league. As an added bonus, the Fantasy Info guys will include their five secret tips for success in fantasy 